I am Crystal Young. I am Kaylin's high school gymnastics coach. She has been on the team now for two seasons. This will be her third and final season as it is her senior year. Um, so Kaylin, some of the accomplishments that she's had in the recent past is she was named first team all state floor 2018 and 2019, first team all academic 2018, 2019, Gymnast of the Year in District 3 in 2019, All-Conference Gymnast of the Year in 2018 and 2019, First Team All-Conference All-Around in 2018, Honorable Mention All-Around in 2019, First Team All-Conference Floor 2018 and 2019, First Team All-Conference Bars 2018, uh, First Team All-Conference Vault 2018, State Qualifier in many events placing third on floor, in 2018 and fourth on floor in 2019. And the interesting thing for Kaylin on floor in 2019 was um, in January of this year, she had a pretty severe injury on her elbow that was potentially season ending for her. And Kaylin's love for gymnastics was going to supersede that diagnosis. And so instead of giving up, Kaylin really focused on what she could do instead of what she couldn't do. So, you know, with Kaylin's perseverance, we decided that she was going to do the things she could do using no hands. So she did not compete vault for the rest of the 2019 season, did not compete bars for the rest of the 2019 season, but was able to compete floor and beam both of which she qualified for state and both of which she did incredibly well, being fourth place out of an entire Division I state championship without being able to use her arm was an, a feat that we know as gymnastics coaches is really hard to do. So who Kaylin is on the gymnastics team is, uh, is a very humble leader. She she lifts her teammates up. She doesn't necessarily love to be the center of attention, but she is there for the camaraderie. She is there to be the best gymnast she can be. She never quits. She's constantly learning. She always wants more. And I think that would make her a great addition to any college program. And she's incredibly intelligent and sweet and uh, even brings treats to the other teams at the gymnastics meets because she she just wants everybody to always feel welcomed and and part of the world that she loves so much. So Kaylin puts in the time year round. This isn't a sport that she does between November when our season starts and March when our season ends. Kaylin is going to summer camps and she's regularly participating still in her scheduled in her scheduled programs during the summer. And, you know, every camp that she can get her hands on is what she wants to do. Now, she was recently cleared to be back to full capacity. And I think that was probably some of the best news she's gotten all year. <laughs> um, you know, Kaylin's mom once told me, and I, I love this quote, is that a day without gymnastics is like a day without sunshine for Kaylin. And I, I don't know that I've ever heard truer words spoken about who Kaylin is as a gymnast. Um, outside of gymnastics, I think that Kaylin is also incredibly academically talented, and I know that that's a, a big deal for sports programs at college is that we need to have well-rounded athletes who are focused on their academics as much as they are on their sports careers, and Kaylin has had absolutely no problems balancing those two things in, in the high school capacity, and I know given Kaylin's drive and, and her talent that that is going to continue to carry on through her college career. So, uh, you know, like I said, Kaylin as an athlete is humble and thoughtful and determined. Her desire to continually push herself to be the best gymnast she can be is apparent to, in, on every single day. When she's not in the gym, she's working out and she's conditioning at home. And, you know, the amount of desire that she has is, 
is really something that a lot of coaches don't see all the time. She's she's a very, very special gymnast when, you know, she sets her minds to goals. She she does what she can to accomplish them and it isn't without blood, sweat and tears, but she knows how to get the job done when she focuses her mind on tasks that she wants to complete.